Good afternoon, YouTube. This is Donovan coming back at you with another blade today, my man. This is the uh, Glock Model 18 service knife. It has a six and a half inch blade. Uh, I have no idea what steel is they use on this. I would love to know though, because I'll tell you something. This is probably one of the sharpest damn knives I have ever gotten out of the box. I can't really remember what I paid for it, but I bought it brand new, and uh, it's made in Austria, and uh, man, this is a really nice balls out kind of freaking knife, man. I did a little research on it, and I found out that some units in the uh, German military actually use this knife. A lot of their special forces use it as a backup knife. A lot of their mountain rescue people use it. It has an extremely sharp edge, really aggressive teeth on the spine. I mean, this thing will get it done, man. It was crazy sharp. I cannot believe how sharp this thing was. And uh, comes with a really nice thermoplastic sheath. Now, the one drawback about this knife is real contrary to get in and out of the sheath. Maybe if it was on your belt, it may would be... A simpler way of removing it but when you insert the knife this little plastic ring locks over the guard there and prevents it from falling out but it, it it's kind of at a odd way you have to kind of push the thing open to get the knife to deploy and it's it's just a real pain in the butt I guess if you practice at it a little while you'd get it to go through but um, it's an awesome knife, man. It really is. Let me show you in the hand. That's how big it is. And by having a six and a half inch blade, that's a pretty odd size. You never really find them. They're either going to be six or they're going to be seven. But to have a six and a half, that's kind of kind of odd. It has a uh, about an inch and a half long false edge at the top. Wouldn't take much to get that really sharp. But um. I mean, I'm not going to do that. I'm going to keep it just like it is. I don't own a Glock handgun. I'm the kind of guy, man, I want my guns to be made out of metal. And uh, I just never had the pleasure of shooting a Glock. But uh, their knives are really cool. I would have loved to seen this thing about an inch and a half wide or maybe a little bit wider than a k-bar that would have been awesome it would have been an epic battle blade then for sure but uh guys i would actually depend on this knife i, I really would i'm not sure what the tang is on it but um it's got to be tough i mean to be a rescue knife and for special forces to choose it it's uh it's probably pretty kosher blade but I wanted to show that to you. This is the Model 18 Glock Service Knife. If you ever want to get a chance to own this and put it in your collection, you can't go wrong. I believe you can get it in black, OD green, gray, and the fade dark earth. So, uh, guys, I appreciate you watching, as always. Uh, as this election drags on, I just want to remind us of one thing that 22 veterans a day take their life and that's something that is extremely bothersome to me it it really is if you add that up in a month's time you've lost a brigade of good fighting men and women that were just lost and they needed all they needed was somebody to talk to somebody to say hey man tomorrow might be a better day just give it till tomorrow and try brother you'd be surprised um i want all my veterans to know i love y'all man and i appreciate everything you've ever done for us um i appreciate all our law enforcement guys i know y'all going through a tough time right now just uh hold your ground brother and um hopefully we'll get through this we'll come out on top and we can make this nation great again
All right, guys, I appreciate all your comments, and I appreciate you watching. You fellas stay safe out there. This is Donovan from Mississippi, and I'm out of here.